participated in gouging out the eyes of baby Brighton Sagini Jr. in December last year, today took to the stand to defend themselves at the Kisi Law Courts. The main suspects, Pacifica Nyakerario, Alex Uchogo, and Ryle Nyakerario, appeared three weeks after the case was adjourned. Maina Ochogo, the main suspect, had a difficult time explaining where he was on the fateful day. During cross-examination, the prosecution focused on the testimony of of Ochogo being seen on the fateful day with a sack stained with blood and a knife believed to have been used to torture the child. Emily Chebet reports. Three relatives implicated in baby Brighton Sagini's case appeared before Kisi resident magistrate Christine Ongweno to defend themselves against accusations of torture and causing grievous harm to the three-year-old boy in December last year. Sagini's aunt Pacifica Nyakerario and his cousin Alex Maina Ochogo were cross-examined by the prosecutor. Ochogo having a difficult time explaining his whereabouts on the fateful day. Wakati polisi wali muleta, waka, waka muoji, waka kuoji pia. Wali muoji, wali enda Nairobi, na alisema uwe uli msindikisa waki enda Nairobi mbaka Palestine ya kisindi ya kaenda. Yeah. Uli msindikisa mama. Mm -hmm. Mura uh, alisema, uh, lunch ulisema uku wanekana nyumbani, uku, uku kuja nyumbani kukula lunch. Haa, siku kuja. Mm. Mm -hmm. uh, umeambia kutu kwamba, our chief Ochogo was taken to task to explain a state witness account which matched that of his mother that he was seen with a sack stained with blood and a knife the day baby Sagini was tortured. Morani, sister. So Mora Pia we found that he had a knife and a sack. The case will continue on the 5th of May 2023 when the three suspects are expected to carry on with their defense. Emily Chabet, Citizen TV, Nairobi.